Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. My name is Keisha, and in today's video, I wanted to do a little um, weight loss update, tell you guys where I've been at um, health related and where I want to go, my goals, um, what's coming towards the channel with like um, wellness type of videos. So wanted to get into that. Let's just start with what's been going on. Basically nothing. That's the easiest way to put it. I haven't been doing anything. <clears throat> I haven't been in the gym in about, I'm going to say uh, two to three weeks I have not been in the gym. I might have went to the gym once or twice this month. Um, no excuses. I had the time, all that good stuff. I just haven't been in the gym. Um, I've been eating like crap. I've been feeling like crap. Even with my face, I'm feeling really bloated. Like, look what's in front of me right now. Like, yeah, it's been a lot um side note if you guys didn't know i had weight loss surgery back in 2019 and when you have weight loss surgery you know the first year or like 18 months you talk to a doctor and you guys get checkups blah blah, blah dietitian nurses all that stuff so after a year you have an option which you should go to your um practice every year and just like you know talk about a few things get some help some tips so I know in 2022, I talked with them and I was about 235 in 2022 at the time. Um, and I would like fluctuate between like 228 to 235 around that area, which was cool. And then now I'm at 258, 261. Like that's probably at the highest I have been. The 260s is like, are you serious? So um, I've been talking with, I talked with the dietitian and I also talked with the nurse and I actually asked her, do you guys do any like reversals or extensive um, sleeve or bypass just because I haven't lost any weight? And they said no, unless you're having complications. And luckily I am not. So it was just a question and I will not be getting further surgery or anything like that. I just wanted to know. So I made a little folder and she actually emailed me a few things and I just went on about my own just to find some things. And basically she was just talking about going back to the basics, like um, back to high protein. So um, she sent me like a list of things. So she said for me to get back onto tracking using an app, whether it's my fitness pal or um, bariatrics is which I'm which is what I'm probably going to use um protein intake she told me to up my protein because I was telling her how I've just been snacking like crazy on empty calories like this is 200 calories per stick but it's like nothing you know what I mean like it's just sugar it's no like protein it's not going to make me full so she was saying my protein intake needs to be at least 60 to 80 calories 60 to 80 um grams a day of protein we were talking about calories and she said most of the time it's around 1000 to 1200 however because i stretch my stomach out so much i can easily get in 2000 calories now that wouldn't be meal based but let's say if i had four of these that's already 800 calories because i had four of these and these are not filling at all so there's that um so i said for myself to give myself at least 1500 calories a day just to shrink my um stomach back again um we talked about vitamins and then she talked about eating slowly she also talked about the difference when you do have weight loss surgery to eat first and then drink or drink first and then eat so we talked about that but my main thing that i really want to look into when um <clears throat> besides tracking is high protein snacks so i literally like made a list of um some and i'll just read off a few that i know i'm going to be trying or just implicating in my everyday life like i'm really trying to hit that 60 to 80 protein just to see you know um i haven't tried that theory in so long so i want to get back to getting a lot of protein in so i just put cheese greek yogurt deli meat roll-ups jerky eggs trail mix um fruit with yogurt dip tuna and crackers apple and peanut butter um almonds cottage cheese and protein shakes in the protein waters excuse me so those are just a few that i wrote down she wrote down a few but i didn't really, i wasn't really feeling her list the only ones i really didn't say um lint cooked lentils peanut seeds um okay um high protein and fiber snack bars i do love bars and protein bars so that's another good one 
but I would really have to look at like low calorie, high in protein because I really want to look at, you know, what I'm eating and tracking. And I told her I, I've tracked before a lot of the times. However, it gets redundant after a while. And you get when once you do get in the groove of thing, that's when I tend to stop. So um, yeah, I want to see how this works for me. I will be starting this in June, which is literally like three days away. And I'm actually really excited. Um to really track, to really meal prep, um, look at my protein, really trying to hit goals for a fro. And not really weight loss goals, but really just to feel better. Um, you guys know it's always that weight that once you're there or once you're like 10 pounds up from that max, like my max is usually like 250. And now that I'm at 260, it's just like blah. Like I, tr I pulled out my summer clothes and I couldn't fit anything because I was in a size 14 for like two or three years and now that I'm barely in a um a 16 basically an 18 I don't have any 18s I haven't been in an 18 in years so it's just like it's just like a lot mentally physically like it's always a lot so um yeah I'm super excited to get back on the bandwagon and really just get back to um weekly weigh-ins um grocery haul snack ideas posting my weight loss journey as really a journey and not really a weight loss goal as of right now we're just trying to get back in the motion of things and try to create healthy habits so if you guys are on a weight loss journey definitely let me know what you're doing down below what's your favorite snacks your favorite meal ideas um are you tracking don't you track like let me know down below and i'll talk to you guys in my next video bye guys